Coach Jimmy here, your story coach, and you're gonna to wanna to subscribe to this video, like it, because today we're talking the godfather of storytelling. Okay, just checked off bucket list item for me. If you haven't met before, my name is Jimmy Hayes Nelson, and before becoming a storytelling coach, my background was in acting as a performer, musical theater performer, and I am standing outside of Shakespeare's Globe Theater here in London, and this, this is, is, is the mecca for all storytelling. When I tell people the most effective way that they want to have an impact on somebody is telling a story. Not just facts and figures and, and why their business helps them or whatever their cause is, but if you can really tell a story, if you can capture something uh, in, in a narrative form for somebody, that you can have a bigger impact. Well, if we think about Shakespeare, you want to talk about having an impact far beyond your years, hundreds of years that think of how many sayings and movies and other things ha have come from the stories that this gentleman told. A full of scorpions is my mind. It's done, it's done. From Tony Award winning director Julie Taymor, Academy Award winner Anthony Hopkins. I shall grind your bones to dust. And it was really interesting walking through there and thinking that now in 2019 and hearing all the history of like when these stories were written that he probably had no idea the impact that he was going to have. And I think that happens for all of us so much. We don't think our story is good enough. We don't know, uh, we don't think that it's really going to have a big impact. But if you have the, the courage, the, the wherewithal to step out and tell a good story, regardless of what you think about it, it's not so much about what you think about it, right? It's about how that audience receives it. What do they do with it? Maybe it sparks a different version of that story. And that's what Shakespeare's stories did again and again and again. It gives us phrases. Uh, it created new parts of a language. And so for me, it, this was just a super humbling experience to be in the midst of the ultimate storyteller, to remember not to keep my stories to myself not to prejudge them and think they're not good enough. And I'm gonna encourage you to do the same thing. I would love to hear from you. What's your story? What's that one that you haven't told that you think's not good enough, that's embarrassing, that maybe doesn't put you in the best light? Because I'm gonna tell you, the story that you're hanging on to right now is the one that's gonna impact people. The one that you're not telling right now is the one that's gonna create a cause that's gonna serve the most people. And if you need somebody to help you with that story, I would love to help you. Thank you for taking the time. I'm gonna continue to take in this amazing experience here in London. I, I'm almost speechless for somebody who likes to talk a lot. Just keep telling stories. Tell a story, change the world. Shakespeare's Globe Theater, done. Make sure to check out the rest of the vlog for the rest of the London adventures.